So maybe as let us see what happens if we have this question here. Now this one we are telling us we are still under bounded classes. The table below shows the amount of money shared in the thousands by a group of splits. So above zero to ten, these are in thousands. Listen to that word in thousands. This to this, then this to this, this to this. That is about the y from 10 to 10. I think you see those are bounded. Now you just get these ones and you get your class boundary. It's 0 to 10, 10 to 20, 20 to 30, 30 to 40, 40 to 50. And this. So these are our class boundaries now. To make a frame rest, you said you get this, then you put there one, then you say, this plus this, you get 4. This plus this, you get 4. This plus this, you get 16. Then this plus this, you get 18. Oh, and then you add this one, this is 4. Plus 8 or plus 4, 16. Then also here, we are getting 18. Then our x here, you just get this, divide by this. We shall get 5. Here we shall get 15. You just add on the first thing down. 25, 35, then 45. So now, get our f of x, we get this times this, we get 5, this times this, we get 45, this times this, I think 200. Yeah, 200, then this and this, that is 140. Then this and this, we get a 90. Okay, then when we add that, we get uh, plus 90, plus 200, plus whatever we get here. It's our sum. Now we are getting summation f of x, we get 480. So we come here and we get our mean. Our mean is grade B, summation f of x over summation f. Our summation f of x is 480 over our which is 18. And so the answer we get there is grade B 26.7. And now remember they told us that this amount is in the thousands, now the amount given is in the classes. So now you multiply this answer with a thousand so two six times six six seven then times one thousand. So this will mean now two six comma six 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 point seven shillings. That is the amount they shared now, meaning that the mean was 26,000. Then the median, our median, the formula for the median is given by lower class boundary plus summation f over 2 times i. So we first get this, so our summation f over 2 will be 18 over 2. We need this position value. This position, which will be 90 positions. After getting that, now you come in our automatic frequency. You check where you have reached a 9. So it's that here I have not reached. You check in the many frequency. I have not reached 9. I have not. I have reached 9. So now this one is going to be our median class. So, this will be now our lower class boundary. You see that it's 20. Then, plus, this is 9. Oh, just say 18. Then, minus to the frequency before, which is 4. Over frequency within, which is 8. Then, times our class boundary. The class boundary here is that, that is going to be 10. From here, so that we press your answer. So you say 9 minus 4, you say equals 
then divide by 8 equals diamonds, then equals then plus 20. So that's how it pays. This is 26.25. But now we multiply this result from our 1000. 0.25 now times 1000. Because they were in thousands, these ones, but if this was in thousands, you don't do that. But if it's the class sense, you multiply with thousands. If they send tens of thousands, the same thing. Two six two five fifty ten shillings. And so that's the case. Okay, so that's how we had that in the pass. The difference I want to pull out is when they tell us that they are sharing money, money shared in thousands by in thousands. So after that, you want prime for it with a thousand. If they say in the thousands, but now it's in terms of frequency, they are even if you don't know because we want price, it's going to pass. But if it's in the classes strictly, you want prime with a thousand. Be careful there.